Hey friends, welcome back to our channel where I inspire your desire to be great, to be great, to be great. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, watching another video. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Hey, my name is Christina Mega. Nice to meet you, y'all. So sorry, I could not drop a video last week. Last week, y'all, it was such a long, intense week for me. I pretty much worked late every single day last week except Friday, so I was just too exhausted and I couldn't give y'all quality content as I wanted to. So if it ain't quality, baby, we don't want it, okay? So before I get into it, to my amazing supporters, thank y'all so much for all of your amazing support. I appreciate y'all so much. I love y'all so much. And y'all know the drill. I gotta give y'all some motivation before we get into the crumble part. And then in this motivational part of the video, like I'm gonna talk about having high level energy versus low level energy. And this has been like, not bothering me, but I just been having this experience all week and it only makes sense for me to talk about it. And I feel like when you know where you are going, like there's certain things that's high level energy and there's certain things that's low level energy. And I'm at a place where I stop giving like low level energy stuff my time and my attention. Like I don't got time for that. Like I'll be like, there's so much high level stuff to do that's what I need to keep my energy for. That's what I need to preserve my energy for. And that's what I need to give my energy to. Like, y'all, when I film a YouTube video, I be done because I give it literally every single thing that I got. Like, literally everything. Like, by the time I'm done, I be exhausted. I be tired. I want to sleep. And it's literally, like, anywhere from 10 minutes to 15 minutes. But I put so much into it that... Like by the time I'm done, like, you know, I'm tired and I feel like there's certain things that's just low level energy. And when you give your time and attention to it, you don't got time for the high level stuff. And I feel like if you trying to be somebody, if you trying to get somewhere, like the high level stuff is what gets you where you trying to go. The high level stuff is what gets you where you want to be. So. Basically, all I'm trying to say is preserve your energy to give it to the high level stuff, the things that will actually pay off and reward you how you want them to reward you. That low level stuff, like people gonna hate, hmm. you know, they're gonna be mad. They're gonna feel some type of way. They're not gonna agree with you. They're not gonna like you when it comes to certain things, but just stay focused and don't put energy into that little like low level stuff. So that's pretty much all I got for y'all. We're about to get into these cookies, y'all. Your girl try to box a uh six this week again which is crazy um because i feel like crumble came with it for this lineup and it was only right that i did a box of six and because i missed last week i had to grab at least one off of last week's lineup i didn't screenshot the description so y'all not gonna hear about it And before I continue, I keep forgetting sometimes to promo this coffee in my video. If you are a coffee lover like me, I've grown to become one. Make sure you click the link below to purchase some. I'll put it in the description box for my people that loves it. When I need a little pick me up, uh, you know, or a little thing to kick my day off, that's my go-to for sure. So make sure y'all try it if you haven't tried it already to the people that have tried it. Thank you so much. I love you and I appreciate you. So I'm gonna get straight to it because I'm gonna visit to be tuned on either and oh because it's six i might not be able to try like usually i try in like how do i say usually i try um like a quarter of it but i'm gonna have to try like one eighth of it so that i can have room and as y'all can see <laughs> I got my milk and I got ice in it this time because y'all know if it don't got ice in it, baby, it's water. And who wants water for milk? Not me. So that's what it is. Ouch! That's what it ain't. I'm going to cut these like I told y'all because your girl is not going to do like a full portion. So while I'm doing that, I'm going to start. And I'm going to start with the cookies and cream one only because, not cookies and cream, the cookie dough one because I don't have a description for that one. But the first one on the lineup is milk chocolate chip. Um, Y'all know it's a regular regular. And it says the classic, you can't go wrong. Thick, soft, and packed with milk chocolate chip. Next one on the lineup 
is carrot cake, y'all. And y'all know, like, I love a good carrot cake for sure. I would definitely say it's probably one of my favorite desserts. So I had to snatch one. And it says a spiced carrot cake swirled with cream cheese frosting and a crunch of pecan garnish. Huh, I'm gonna try that one next. Because it's next. If it's residue on a knife, I can't use it to cut the next cookie because I don't want it to like mess up the taste. So I'm gonna try this one next. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, the next one on the lineup a little strawberry cheesecake. And this one has a chili. Cheesecake cookie with a buttery gray ham base, vanilla cream cheese frosting, homemade strawberry jam, and gray ham cracker crumbs. So that's the next one I'm gonna try. Y'all, I'm actually sharing this with my family too because baby, this is a lot. So, mm. Something about that strawberry. The next one on the lineup is a buttermilk pancake. It says a warm pancake cookie topped with buttermilk glaze and a buttercream dollop. <laughs> I don't know why that word is so funny to me, but cheers to a buttermilk pancake cookie. I don't want to get full too fast, y'all. People usually tell me that I consume a lot of food, in which I usually am able to, but that's because I don't drink what I don't drink my beverage like while I'm eating. Most of the time, I wait to towards the end of me eating. Mm. And the next one on the line up was this one. I was really, really excited to try it because you know. I just thought it would be interesting to try it. So, I'm gonna show y'all what it is when I'm done cutting it. Ah! I don't know thing, y'all. I was gonna wait to do this video, but I gotta get my teeth fixed tomorrow. Gotta beg and fix my teeth. <laughs> okay, y'all, but for real, I gotta get my teeth fixed tomorrow. And I was like, depending on how the procedure go, I may or may not be able to film. And I was like, I can't let my people down. I can't let my supporters down. So I thought I just gotta film today and then edit and drop at some point this week. I like dropping on Fridays. I've genuinely come and come to enjoy dropping on Fridays. So that's what I've really been doing. But I was gonna wait till tomorrow or Wednesday to film. But like I said, I gotta get my teeth fixed. So that's what it is. And I can't chew, I'm not supposed to chew on this side of my mouth until I get my teeth fixed. So this one, I forgot to tell y'all, the, the deets, the deets, the details. <laughs> okay, but all jokes aside, this one is a pumpkin brownie. Like, baby, Crumble stepped it up with this one. They stepped out their comfort zone with this one. and. It says a chocolate cookie topped with pumpkin cheesecake frosting, chocolate ganache, and brownie crumbs. The brownie crumbs got me for sure. The pumpkin cheesecake frosting got me for sure because y'all know I am not a chocolate type of girl, but I did want to risk it all this time and try some chocolate for you all. So that's what your girl's doing. And let's see what they talking about. That's cool. And then this one knocked my socks off. I ain't gonna lie. Mm. Last one is the honey bun one. And this has a deliciously rich cinnamon cookie smothered with a honey butter glaze. So I'm about to rate these cookies 
I do need to try the honey bun one though first. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright, I'm gonna start backwards and then go. The honey bun one, I'll give that one a six because it's dry. It doesn't give what a honey bun usually is, like soft and moist. I feel like it could have been did better with that one. Maybe the pumpkin brownie, you gotta get into it, you know? You know when you need in the dough? And gotta get into it like for real. That's how it is with that one. You gotta really get into it. Like that pumpkin brownie one, I would definitely give it a 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. And I'm shocked because y'all know usually I'm not into trying, you know, chocolate or whatever. But this one maybe will want to probably step out my comfort zone a little bit and try the chocolate ones more often. At least the brownie ones let me just say that so that one's a 10 out of 10. the buttermilk pancake that one was a cool eight out of ten all right y'all that one was a cool eight out of ten that one is like if you're looking for a little cookie or whatever or if you need to make up the box of six you could do that one now the strawberry the strawberry baby i like that one so much i would say that one is a 12 out of 10. definitely one of my favorites it was definitely tied with the carrot cake i would give the carrot cake a 12 out of 10 as well like both of them was the absolute bomb they tasted so good they tasted so amazing and the last one that i gotta rate is the cookie dough one that one was cool too. It wasn't my favorite. I would give it a seven out of 10, but crumble overall, I would say like, you know when you shoot in a bow and arrow, this one hit the target. Like this one, y'all really hit the target with this. So that's pretty much all I got for y'all. As I told y'all in the motivational part of this video, like make sure you invest your energy into high level stuff. Like stuff that will really bring you really bring you in the direction where you want to be because it's like y'all ever like engaged in low level stuff y'all know what i'm talking about like the petty stuff like people talking out the side of their mouth people just like not minding their business giving their un um warranted opinions like their unwanted opinions or whatever like when y'all engage in that, you feel drained, you feel tired, you feel exhausted. And then when it's time to do the higher level stuff, you can't, like it's kind of hard to because you gave all your energy to the unnecessary low level energy stuff. So lock in and just give your energy to the high level stuff, man. That's, that's the stuff that's gonna get you where you wanna be. And that's just what I try to do. Like I just try my best to stay locked in, to stay focused. And if I feel like there's low level stuff trying to get my attention, I, if I feel like there's low level stuff that's trying to trick me out my spot or take my mind and my energy off of investing into the higher level stuff, I don't dwell on it too long. I don't pay it too much mind. I just tell myself, you know what, Christina, you can't engage in that. Like, you too big time for that. You can't engage in that. And I just shift my focus. I just shift my energy and just make sure I stay locked in on doing the high level stuff. So that is all I got for y'all. I love y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. And I will see y'all in the next video where I inspire your desire to be great, to be great. <laughs>